Welcome to the extraordinary realm of Azure Labs Speech Studios, where an explosion of AI voices eagerly awaits your arrival. Today, we embark on a thrilling tutorial, unfurling the immense power of Microsoft Azure's cognitive speech services, specifically looking at the free tier today. Prepare yourself for a journey into the boundless realm of text-to-speech voices, each holding unique advantages to enrich your narrations. Delight in the elegance of the United Kingdom accent. Savor the richness of India's tonal tapestry. And revel in the enchanting charm of the Irish lilt. And chuck another prawn on the barbie, mate, so we can kick off this fair dinkum language shindig. Azure's voices bestow an authentic depth upon your creations, igniting them with an undeniable spark of magic. Let us commence this unforgettable odyssey, where the boundaries of imagination and technology intertwine seamlessly. Our first step begins with creating an Azure account. You can sign in with your existing Microsoft account or create a new one enabling you to unlock the wondrous possibilities that lie ahead. The initial Microsoft Azure sign-up may require a credit card, even if you will only be using the free services. If you are just starting off with Azure, then embark on an extraordinary journey by choosing the Start Free option. However, when you have exhausted your month-long trial as I have, it's time to venture into the pay-as-you-go alternative with a clever tactic of utilizing the free text-to-speech options showcased in this tutorial. And you must create a subscription. Go through the five tabs at the top of the form and fill out or update the details starting with a unique subscription name under the basic tab. If you have any specific questions about these forms, you can find out more details by selecting the information represented by an eye with a circle. Next, go to the Advanced tab. Some of these items will be pre-populated or available via drop-down menu, so go through to ensure they are all filled out as per your preferences. On the Budget tab, we will ensure prudence by setting the budget to a minimum of $1, a modest safeguard that provides peace of mind should we inadvertently exceed our intended limit. Proceed to the Tags tab, where we can apply name slash value pairs to categorize resources and achieve consolidated billing. Feel free to assign tags as you see fit, a personal touch to ease resource management. With anticipation mounting, advance to the final step, the Review plus Create tab. Double check the information, confirming it aligns with your intentions, and when you are satisfied, summon your courage and click that fateful Create button. A brief interlude ensues as the deployment takes shape. Once the moment arrives, an exhilarating command awaits, click the Go to Resources button, revealing the precious keys and endpoints for future integration of text-to-speech into your applications. But for now, our destination lies elsewhere. Proceed with purpose, selecting the alluring Go to Speech Studio button. Behold the cornucopia of speech services, an array of possibilities cascading before you. Scroll down with anticipation, for today we embrace the path of text-to-speech and select the wondrous realm of audio content creation. Ah, we have finally made it to Speech Studios, an empty canvas of possibilities. You will start out at My Files. Create a new text file, and then enter the script for your first AI narration, where you can type your script and select your voices. From here you can load, save, export or create a template from the top-hand menu, but right now we are going to explore the wide selection of voices from the right-hand menu. First, under the Voice tab, select the voice you want to sample from the drop-down menu and hit the Play button to experience the voice in its natural dialect. He said that the numbers are amazing in themselves, but in all the meetings of us, the idea is that it is a symptom of something more than it is. הכל פתוח במאבק על המקום האחרון לפלייאוף העליון של ליגת העל בכדורגל. The drop-down menu under language allows you to choose the language as well as the country which affects the accent and dialect. In addition, you can also select the mood for some of the more advanced voices available. Such as me. Nancy! To see a more extensive menu for easier selection choose the three-dotted menu. In addition, you can see that there are various generations of voices here, some with the ability to use emotions, you can customize the speech through adding breaks or insert silence, don't forget to confirm your selection by hitting the check button, and also remember that not all effects and controls work for all voices. You have the ability to change the words punctuation, including phoneme, as well as reading rules. In addition, you can create a custom lexicon to fix pronunciations. Now, we will test out the intonations. I am so happy! 
I am so happy. I am so happy. I am so happy. I am so happy. This is my first script. Yay! I am so happy. And now I am sad. Not bad. Highlight the text and select the eraser to remove any intonations or effects that you want to remove. You can adjust the speaking speed with the rate and the highest and lowest sound with pitch. And finally, you also have the ability to control the volume. Thank you, Nancy. It is such a treat to hear your amazing voice. When you have completed your script and modifying your voices, choose Save and Export. You have the ability to create an .srt file for captions, as well as the ability to save each paragraph as a separate file. We will save ours as one audio file. Give it a moment to generate, and then go over to the bottom left-hand icon to manage the audio output and download it from here. Thanks so much for joining us today. There is so much more AI to explore within Microsoft Azure, so come back soon and see all the wonders that we will have in store.